hey guys, it's M or Fick or whatever you're gonna see. I don't know what platform this is going on. I don't know where this is going, but I just wanna know am I the asshole. Now, I've played Zombie Army for a while. Zombie Army 4 is one of my favorite games ever. I've beat the entire game on Nightmare Hard. Here's like proof of that. I'm level like 200. I've prestiged twice, so I'm like level 202. Here's proof of that, by the way. So I would say I'm pretty into the game. I kind of I know how everything works. I already have my sweat build or whatever. Been through the whole nine with it, right? And you know I don't really play co-op games like that. If I'm playing co-op, it's with my friends because I don't like shouting at random people or getting annoyed when my team does something dumb. But today I just I. I conceded because I'm like okay I want to play zombie army I don't really know what to do I kind of already done the hardest stuff the only thing that's left for me is nightmare brutal and I'm not saying that to go look at how big my dick is I'm just like that's just how it is so I'm like <laughs> I like how I said that like my dick really is that big nah I'm just saying there's not a ton for me to do by myself so I'm like let me check the lobbies it's an old game you know like it's not it's an old not even that popular game so maybe I'll hop on the servers and have a casual little, we just do a mission, right? I see this one group, they're doing hard four man, and they're on like the seventh chapter or something. I'm like, okay, sure, whatever. I peep the levels, you already heard mine. The other two are level 90, and one guy's level 40. But from his trophy list, I'm assuming he didn't beat the game, like the base game. And I'm not saying that the flame, I'm just saying that because it seems like he's new, and that'll become kind of important later. So, I join them, we do one mission, it's fine, we keep going, nothing, nothing really crazy is going on, right? And we get a part with a blood fountain, and if you've played Zombie Army, you know to fill blood fountains, you need to let the zombies in a certain area for them to die, and then that fills it up, and then you can continue the level. The new guy had a heavy machine gun, and he's killing all the zombies before they could even get in the ring, so I'm sitting there... Okay, sure, whatever, he's new. I'm not even mad at this, right? I'm just like, I have my phone, and there's four of us here. The other dude who's level 90, he's chilling in the back. I'm chilling in the back, because I'm like, this dude's gonna make this take a while. Whatever. I even took a photo, because we were posed up kind of cool. Whatever, bro. We the, the fountain takes like 15 minutes. I'm still chilling at this point. We get to the end of the mission, the rest of it was kind of... Like, nothing really important happened. We get to the end of the mission, and there's a fan trap there. And I'm used to this part on Nightmare, so seeing it on normal, I was like, oh, this shit's, this shit's simple, bro. So, we're just going through, killing the zombies, and someone cuts on the fan trap and kills me. I'm not gonna say no names. I have no idea who shot it. I just know someone hit it, and there were no zombies around, so it felt like an assassination attempt on my life. <laughs> so I get killed. And I'm just like, okay, fuck it, whatever. I guess the new guy did it. If anyone else did it, I'd be a little concerned, but whatever. So I'm sitting there chilling on my phone. I'm texting my friends like, bro, I really, I ran into a random group in zombie army and one of them just killed me. And while I'm texting this, another one gets sucked into the fan and I'm like, okay, <laughs> this is, this is going to be a quirky set. And one of them has killed two of us, <laughs> minimum. So I'm thinking, yeah, it's a quirky group, whatever. We end up on the mission that's two chapters before the last chapter where you fight this massive horde, right? And we get on that mission, and when I say I carried them, I, I hard carried them. I killed every heavy that showed up, I soloed a zombie half tank, I cooked. Here's the score to show that I cooked. I cooked. I, I, I cooked and cleaned on that mission. They were going down, it was looking rough for everyone else, I didn't even go down. I was cooking. And again, I'm not even tweaking at this point, I'm like, okay whatever it, it happens so then we reach the first mission of hellbase and if you know how hellbase starts it, it starts with two screamers on both sides of the paths you need to take and knowing the group that i'm with from this limited time we've had together i'm like i'll sit back and watch you guys go past the screamers because i feel like one of you was gonna activate one so the first level 90 guy walks past no he didn't even walk past yet He's crouching past one, as you're meant to do. And then the level 40 guy just starts sprinting forward. And I'm watching the screamer through the scope, because I have super headshot rounds on, so I'm like, okay, I'll drop this dude. And again, if you know this mission, there's a horde of zombies ahead, so you can get a takedown and kill them. I'm playing Hector, I get six kills, and I get a takedown, and the thing instantly dies. Even if we aggro both of them, I could probably kill both of them by myself. I'm cool. So I'm watching the, the screamer through the scope, 
And I'm like, watch this guy aggroes the screamer. The guy runs up, the screamer screams. So I'm thinking, okay, it's already aggroed. It's probably gonna kill this guy. Let me get my headshots off. So I start headshotting the screamer. And I hear someone's mic cut on like, why'd you do that, you funk bitch? Or something like that. Hey, are you damn stupid, eh, bitch? And I'm thinking he's talking to the other guy for activating him. And I'm like, that's a little rude, but I'm not going to say anything. So while I'm headshotting the screamer, I run towards the level 90 guy who already managed to crouch past. I walk towards him to get a better view to shoot the screamer. And he goes, yeah, you punk bitch. I'm like, whoa. What the fuck is this, eh? Why you shoot on them, you fucking bastard? Oh, ammo. Yes, you fucking bitch. What are you mad at me for? My mic isn't even on, by the way. I didn't plan on having a confrontation or talking to these people. Because again, like I said, I was ready for a chill zombie RV session. So, bro starts cursing at me. He has the shotgun mortar and he downs me. Oh, dear, this is bad. Are you done for? Pause. I'm sitting here like, what the fuck is going on? What's he mad at me for? I've got hold, like, technically like three times in the span of this session and he's tweaking on me for two screamers that we could easily kill because there's a horde in front of us and we could get takedowns and just kill them but okay this man's downed me and now he's activated my gamer side <laughs> Normally, if you're playing this game, you can't get up by yourself unless you have second chance or a med kit perk. And again, since I was so sweaty before I stopped playing seriously, I already had the med kit revive. I don't even have second chance on because I'm like, if I have to go down, the game's already over. You know, that used to be my mindset. So I med kit revive myself because this dude's talking crazy. He's like, yeah, yeah, die. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, all right, bro. So I get up like fucking cheering. Like, I'll play the audio for you right now. Oh, dear, this is bad. Are you done for a bad? Yeah, die. Come on, die. Almost God. like, it's almost like shit. brother ran into him already and he would have ate your ass. But it's fine. Die. Yo, eat both my balls. Eat both my balls. Both of them at the same time. Shut your ass up. We can come back from it if you want to stop bitching about it. <laughs> I wasn't trying to team kill. I didn't even want to shoot on bro. But while I'm trying to tell him what happened, he shoots at me again and I'm like, all right, fuck you. And I, <laughs> I down him and I hit him with a classic zinger and the bitch kicks me. Am I in the wrong? Am, is it me? Is it me? I've laid the whole situation down bare. Is it me? And even in the in the fucking clip, you can hear me go, we can keep going and save this if you want to stop being such a little bitch. And he kicks me. Let's, let me know. Let me know. Was it me? Was I in the wrong there? Because I think, bro, as the kids say, we're smoking dick. I think, <laughs> I think. Anyway, I'll hand it off to you guys. Tell me, am I the sinner in this situation? Did I do this? <laughs> did, I, did I allow craziness to ensue? Tell me in the comments, man. I didn't want no violence, but I'm not a pacifist. <laughs>